German Skynex anti-aircraft artillery systems have begun to protect the Ukrainian skies. Footage of this system is shown in the official video for the Ukrainian Air Force Day. The complex was developed by German Rheinmetall Air Defense Militani reports. The publication explained that the main task of Skynex is object air defense. Since the gun mounts are not self-propelled, they are used to protect airfields and critical infrastructure facilities. The Skynex battery consists of four 35mm gun mounts, a control post and a radar station that detects the target and directs the gun towards it. At the same time, the gun mounts also have their own radar station, which is combined with an optical system. First of all, they are used to capture air targets, and the use of an optical system ensures high accuracy against small targets. In 2022, Rheinmetall announced that it would manufacture two Skynex batteries for a European country and requested funding from the German government. Some time later, the media reported that Ukraine would receive these two batteries worth 182 million euros. The transfer of the systems took place as part of military aid from Germany, which the Ukrainian armed forces received earlier this year. Skynex is an evolution of Rheinmetall's SkyGuard system, already in use by 60 countries. It includes a 31-mile range radar, a command post and four guns equipped with electro-optical sensors and tracking radar. These guns can fire 1,000 rounds per minute, targeting threats up to 2.5 miles away. A notable advantage of Skynex is its cost efficiency. While the cost of a single Iris-T missile ranges between 300,000 and 500,000 euros, intercepting a target with Skynex costs approximately 4,000 euros. The system itself is valued at $90.5 million. In addition to its cost benefits, Skynex is capable of neutralizing not only kamikaze drones, but also cruise missiles. Its integration allows it to receive target information from a unified command center, making it a vital element of a comprehensive air defense system.